going live. Mm-hmm. Cause mine, I turn on and off sometimes. Good morning, folks. Good morning. This is Blake Castle with Body Elastics and the Muscle Building Show. Chiseled. What's going on? Trying to get our systems right because. Good morning. Good morning, Nicole Andrews. Good morning to you, Blake. Hey, good morning to you and top of the morning. <laughs> We've got an EMOM today. So, second workout of this program. EMOM means every minute on the minute. It's used a lot by the CrossFit community. We use it with bands, and I think it's even better with bands. The first two exercises to get out of the way, we're going to hit our weak point stuff. So, we're going to be working on our calves and reverse fly. Ooh. So, we're going to do um, seated high row as well. So, okay. let's get our calf raise going. So, calves, bottom of the leg, on the back. We stand up. Hold on a second. Let me make sure our levels are right, and they are. Um, so anytime that we stand up on our toes, we are using the calves. We're doing that right now. My calves are killing me from running on the beach the other day. Are they? They're actually stabbing me right now. They're stabbing me. All right, here we go. So I'm going to put my band through two bottom anchors. You can use one anchor if that's all you have. Make sure that you lock your door regardless of what side of the door that you're on. I'm going to grab the bands back to the door. Nicole, we're going to stand up on our toes through the big toe. I'm going to lean forward like I'm in a long jump oh, I, situation. I need handles for this, so you're just going to grab the underneath the anchor here. All yep, right. and then we're going to come on out. Of course, you can put handles on. You can bring your arms up to, bar, I call it bar position. Um, like I'll show you that like in a second. Jump. I say we go for 50 reps. That means standing up on your toe, but through your big toe. I don't want you to roll your ankle, and we're going to do this for 50. You ready? Ready. In three, two, one. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. This will not help working off all those extra LBs from eating all of that candy, Nicole. I don't eat Easter candy. That's for my kids. Up, 24, 25, 6, 7, 8, 9, 30. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. What did you say? With One, yeah, two, oh, three, oh. Four, Ooh. five, six, seven, eight, nine, fifty. Ay, ay, ay. So I'm going to get my handles. I'm going to get my bands and my handles and my ankle straps, all the goodies. But right now I'm going to put the handles on the ends of the band and do what I call bar position, which is bring the hands up like I have a bar across my back. And this time we're going to slow it down. So more time under tension, more work on the muscles. Is this different? Is this a di it's working the same thing. I'm going to stretch the band a little bit more by bringing my arms up to bar position. And we're going to go up, up. So it's one, two for 25. You ready? Ready. So we go up, 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 two, up, three, up, four, up, six, <laughs> up, seven, right. Eight. I think they're sideways though, aren't they? Nine, they're side, they're just ten, one, up, two, up, three, up. Four, five, six, up, seven, up, eight, nine, up, this twenty. Calf killing, I five know. more. Oh, baby. By the way. Five, Ow. four, three, two, Even and one. Runs. While we have that bottom anchor set up, we're going to go into, I think I said, into high rows. High rows. So it's going to look like this. Um, keep your door anchor at the bottom. I'm going to. Lighten up just a little bit. Blake likes to place his bands in a sloppy mess, and I like to keep mine hung up on the wall. Is that what I do? For whenever I need one. I just because after mind. the workout, I always look over at your side, and it's a disaster. <laughs> okay. Ready? The opposite. All right. So you're going to be sitting on the floor and what, facing the door. What um, resistance is that? I've got a 30. So your knees are together, your feet are flat on the floor, okay. your arms are up, mm. and it's a high row. You're going to pull back like this. Okay. Working on the rear shoulder, Bottom, the posterior part of the shoulder, which is the rear part of the shoulder, back here. And we're going to go for 20 reps. Okay. Um, let me see if there's a better position. So 
I actually like that better, which is cross-legged. Um, I like it. But you're, she's doing a row, if you see what she just did. So it's not here, like a back row. Right. It's now palms facing down yeah. towards the floor and pulling up. Elbows and look, out. until that elbow, elbow's even with the shoulder. Gotcha. You ready? Good cue. This isn't the most manly way to sit. I don't care. Criss ready? Cross Three. Applesauce. Crisscross applesauce. Thank you. Two, one. There's one. Two, three, four, five, six, it's seven, fast. eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, Join nine, twenty. Let's up. get five more. Three, two, one. We've got one more set of those. Keep your back nice and erect with that. It's easy to slouch, but. Right. Try to keep that chest up. So a proud chest. Chest is up. Let's go for our second set. You ready, Ski Daddy? Daddy, ready. Here we go. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, Ooh. seven, eight, Elbows back. nine, Elbows twenty. Wow, we five more. Five alive. Five, four, three, two, one. Ooh, I like to hold on to him and then just round out my back. So Blake didn't look very manly, but his arms look bigger, his, his posterior shoulder. All right, roll-ups. If you've never done these before, I'm going to show you how to do these. Great way for warming up the legs before we get into something like squats. So come on over here, Nicole. You can do roll-ups right next to me. With the, um, you want to get a mat? I think I'm going to probably do a 19 for my roll-ups. Okay. Really great to have a mat for this because you need a mat for this because we're going to be kind of sitting down on the floor and then rolling up. I'm going to double this handles. one over. Right, we use handles for this one. You can use handles for this one. You could use ankle straps if you wanted. I'm going to use handles. I'm going through my top anchor. Put that door anchor to the top of the door. Whew. Really try to be on the side of the door so that the door closes towards you. So as you're pulling on the bands, you are literally closing the door at the same time. So you are going to face that door. You are going to sit your butt down so it almost touches the floor. Roll back gently and up. Ooh, that's a heavy one. Let me see that form again. Well, Good. Okay, let's go for eight. You ready? Yeah. I'm going to pull the mat back just a hair. Yeah, so, so you have to adjust how far away from the door your mat is so that it's at the right spot. Ooh. You ready to crisscross applesauce? I actually... What are you doing? This time, I'm going to grab a 13, especially that you moved it back a little bit. All right, for those of us that want to play the Jeopardy music, go ahead. Otherwise, I am starting without you. <laughs> That's fine. That's a good thing. Roll though. and up. So what's the advantage here? The advantage here is that, we have, is that we have the assistance of the bands helping us to stand up and gently warming up the knees and the hips. Sometimes you have to find out what resistance feels best. And then you could, of course, do a little bit of plyo. You almost just kicked me in the face. Never! <laughs> Nicole's complaining because we wash out our plates and stuff in the other sink. And she said, it smells like something died in here. And I said, well... The, well, you can't smell. So. Someone left a fish outside. It's been sitting there for a couple of days. And I said, <laughs> do you have a bad smell? You know? She said, yeah. So I wiped my finger on the fish, and then I wiped it under her nose. Yeah. I said, how about now? She goes, I don't smell that, that other smell now. But now I smell the fish. All right, ready? Not at all. You just come up halfway with this. You don't have to. You can come up pretty much all the way. If you feel like it, just don't lock the knees. Up and a few more. Come on, after this, set up for squats. Okay. Oh, those are fun. Right? You don't have to use, you don't have to use your door anchor for squats. You can do squats without the anchor. Whatever. I prefer, whatever you say, I prefer the ultra anchor or door anchor for squats because I can get deeper into my squat and not worry about standing on the bands. I love so, the ultra anchor. Well, why don't you marry it? Well, what would somebody have otherwise? So it looks like this. They, they may just have one door anchor 
the thing move around the door, so it'd be at the bottom of the, oh, okay. the door, so it looks like this. This is going to be my squats. Ooh, right there. So here's what we're going to do. I had 10 squats. I was doing 10 squats, but the problem is <clears throat> then we're doing um, one arm kickbacks. So we're going to go for eight squats. Remember, it's one on the way up, explosive rep. You're slowing it down on the way down, kind of like you're gliding with a parachute, and then you're up again, and you glide, and up, glide. We're getting more time and attention on the negative part, super, super effective. And then we're coming over here, and we're going to be doing bent over kickbacks, working on the triceps. Okay. So that would be one, glad that's going to be too much resistance. But that is our form right there. So. If I'm using my left arm, I'm stepping on the band with my right foot, okay? Arm comes up to where that upper arm is parallel with the floor, elbow stationary, and glide. Go. Two, glide, three, glide, and then we'll do the other side. So I say we had, I had 10, and then 10, we're gonna go eight and eight. So eight, and then eight per arm. Whatever time is left over in the minute, you've gotta complete that every minute. Whatever time is left over is time to rest, and I'm about to start that timer. And then step on the exact same. Remember, side. your first couple of minutes that we're doing it, you're going to say it's not enough resistance. Then it starts to get nasty in, in minutes three, four, and five. So stick with it. Here we go. Starting with squat -a. Too cool for school. You ready? Squat a lot. -a. Squat a lot. -a. Up, glide. Two, glide. Three, Push through the heel. four. Five, chest up. Six, hinge from the hips. Seven, eight. Remember, chest up, be a heel squatter, and hinge from the hips. Now we go over for tricep. Tricep. Remember, there's no T on One, oh, sorry. Two, glide. Three, four, five, glide. Six, Ooh, seven, eight. Other arm, other foot, set it up. One, Two, glide. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. What do we have left for time? 17 seconds is time to rest. We get ready for squats again at the top of the minute. You're doing a row. It's tricep. It's kickback. My goodness That's gracious. Why Squat it's time. important for you to show I, and tell. One, Two, three, Woo. four, five, six, seven, eight. It does get heavy. Watch me now. Stand in my band with my right foot. Grab it with my left. Look, arm goes up to parallel. Oh, doing kickbacks. Right. Row. One, See? two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Other side. And one, two, three, four, Ooh, five, you guys got six, this. seven, it. eight. It's always a challenge for me when I write the programs to make sure that they flow really well. Get ready, guys. Seven seconds left of rest. Ooh. We're hitting it again. Eight reps, squats. One, two, I could have gone heavier. Three, Don't lock out your knees. four. Five. Save the knees. Six. And the bees. Seven. Woo. Eight. And the nephews. <laughs> Didn't you say the knees? The knees. I said the knees and the bees. And I said the so knees and the nephew. One, bees two, three. Who would be a beekeeper? Four, <laughs> five, six. <laughs> maybe a reptilian. Seven. Surprised. Eight. Other side. Back. Nicole's brother. Here we go. Four is fine. One, honey. two. <laughs> Three, four, honey is money. Seven, eight. We still have two more. I feel like bees are attracted to me now. He stung me on the back. So and then you stepped on one. And I stepped on one. <laughs> but that was, that'll learn you for taking really? someone's. Exactly. Here we go. The bees like, that did one, help you so much. two, three. Four, I think I'll five, stick with six, cold laser seven, therapy. eight. Ooh, slide down. Yeah, so Nicole's brother stung her for back pain, 
And then she was on the beach. Therapy. Then she was on the beach and saw a rose on the beach that someone, <laughs> two, three, had left for a dead loved one or somebody. You don't know exactly. They may so, have just thrown a rose. And other side. Slow it down on the negative. Positive is here. Yeah, right. Positive is here. One, two, glide. Three, glide. Four, five, six, seven, eight. And then beautiful rose there for Grandpa Pap. And then... No, that was not. <laughs> Nicole walks over and goes, Oh, look, a rose! Free roses! Ready? Here we go. Next set. One, two, Three, four, five. I threw it back in the six, ocean. Seven. So the wish could come eight. through, but there was a bee on it. No, because then you ruined. Behind, and I stepped on the bee. You made your own wish, and then God punished you. Said, not nice, Nicole. And here we go. One, two, you guys three, keep moving. four, back and forth, five, back and forth. six, seven, Make sure that eight. Other side. through that burn. So keeping your form, elbow in, One, abs in. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I saw some trainer somewhere, some trainer who, a lot of these trainers become famous trainers for stupid reasons. And he said, yeah, I think the bands are good for, uh, bands are good for, you know, supplemental Job. exercise, but... You know, because they don't Good create time. steady tension. What is this? And another band hey, company? No. Oh. Some trainer. Hey, Chief, how old are you? The, the, the trainer. I'm talking to him. Hey, Chief, how old are you? Yeah. Have you done 1,600, 1,700 workouts with the bands? Oh, you haven't? Shh. Then be quiet. 51, <laughs> that, not a free weight in sight. Then come talk to me. Okay. What do we have? Hamstrings curl and lateral raise. I planned this so the guys wouldn't have to move once we're hooked in for hamstring curl. Come on over here for hamstrings curl because I have the mat. Okay. Your door anchor goes bottom of the door. Close that door and lock it. And put on your ankle straps around your ankles. That was a bad joke. They're like both two things that have common names that could also be known as male names. A Matt and a John. <laughs> so... Good joke. What, what was the joke you just said? Matt and John. You said I have a Matt. I said oh, I have a John. Boo. Okay. <laughs> Let's pull that out. No, no. Where are you pulling but, that? We can go the other way. Over here, dear. Okay. okay. Put on your ankle straps. That's I'm missing mine, or Nicole took mine. Okay. So. I'm gonna use an eight for this. What are we working here? We're working the back of the legs, your hamstrings, back here. Bend the legs, and we're working the lateral shoulder, takes the arms out, making our T. So we're doing both. So if you have two sets of ankle straps, you can use that. If not, you're using your ankle straps for your lying hamstrings curl, which I'm going to use my 13 for that. If you don't have body elastic bands, you just have to find the right resistance. Pardon me. I know you did your glute challenge, and it got a little bigger and a little stronger, but don't hog the studio with your glutes. You did my glute challenge. Here we go. That's a surprise to me. No, I filmed you doing your glute challenge. Oh, I was going to say, I don't know if you did the glute challenge. Not yet, but if I, you don't want old man behind. Because you're a wuss it. Whatever. If That's you don't right. want old man behind, it's old a good. Man behind. All right. Old man. So 12 hamstrings curls. I just got like the worst picture in my mind. You have to I don't know what push, you're talking about. Push your hips down to the ground on this one because if your hips come up, it's going to really strain your lower back. Here are two exercises. You ready? Here's lying hamstring curl like Nicole was just doing. Come on out from that door. Make sure there's a little bit of stretch on that band, a little bit of tension at the start, and then heels to the buttocks while we keep our hips down. None of this stuff. Keep your hips down. Press them in. Tap the toes here. If you're tensing your feet like this, I want you to point your toes. Otherwise, keep your feet relaxed. Tap your toes and heels to the buttocks. Okay, and that's 12 with the glide. And then we're going to backpedal it up, and we're going to grab our bands. Look at the mess Nicole made over here in my bands. <laughs> that's what I'm saying. That's and, why I don't do that theory. Right, and up, glide, lateral that's raise. Down. So, shoulders stay down and back. No shoulders for earrings. Internally rotate the arms so the elbows lead out to the side and down. If you're having pain higher up, stay three-quarter. 
right here and down, up, okay, no gain. down, working on the okay. side shoulder right here. Okay, start that timer. It's gonna be heavy. Ski daddy. All right, okay, you're not going to start that timer. I'm going to start that timer. Five minutes, five. same drill. 12 and 12. 12 reps and 12. And then whatever time left over is time to rest. One, glide. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. You are certainly welcome to move out away from the door if you need more tension. And now we're going into our lateral raise. Little bend in the legs Take the, takes the pressure off the spine. Up, two, three, glide, four, five, six, and if you're seven, eight, nine, you're stronger than you ten, are, you eleven, for that. twelve. If you are way behind Nicole, like Nicole, <laughs> the advantage of watching it like this is that you can pause the video exactly. unless you're doing it live and, that's what most and get set. Have to do. Because sometimes, especially when they're just getting these thingies, they don't really know exactly. You have six seconds, and you're in my way because I have to do my lying hamstring. No, side, laterals, laterals. Go. I'll catch up. You know, you say that I don't listen to you. <laughs> do you really? Four, five, six. Seven, down. eight, nine, glide, 10, glide, 11, slow, 12, slow, back pedal it up. Get ready for lateral raise, again. Standing in my bands, and one, glide, two, glide, three, four, five, six, seven, Shoulder can you lead height. with your elbows? Shoulder height. Nine, 10, 11, 12. All right, so stay here. Bring your arms out straight. Okay. Internally rotate. Yes. Now go down and up. So I have a shoulder injury that prevents me, so I can't do the wide fly. Should I don't I? care. Keep going. Do Hurt it. your injury. I'm joking. <laughs> don't do that. You ready? There's a good hurt and a not so good hurt. Right. But that's there's, why I'd be like bands. There's the pain of effort, which is bands. my hamstrings start to burn right now. Two, three, and there's the pain I of injury. Used to hurt myself Five, with six. Like always. Seven. Well, that's because you dropped them on yourself. Now it's just Ten, jerky movements. Eleven. Not twelve. Alive. I'm going to do two more. Thirteen. Glide. Fourteen. The first time that we do any of these workouts, any of these routines, sometimes it, you have to figure out what your Ooh, resistance level there. should be. Here we go for lateral raise. One. On it. Two. Three. I'm going. Punch it, four. Margaret. Step on it. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Glide. Eleven. Glide. Twelve. Two more. Thirteen. Fourteen. I like that. Okay. Seven seconds. Right in the core. Here we go. Felt more like mustard. One, two, glide. Three, four, five. No, mustard's good. Six, seven. Eight, nine, ten, eleven, glide, twelve, come on, thirteen, glide, fourteen, glide. Getting more time under tension on the oh. negative. Back, I never pedal it up. Really had hamstrings before the show. Before Here we go. I mean, I had them, but they weren't visible. What now are you talking about? Visible hamstrings. One, two, three, four. I never did with free weights way back in the day. Using bands for hamstrings, I got hamstrings. Ten, four more, four, three, two, glide, one, abs glide. Abs in, abs in. You Ooh, might have to step a little wider on your band. You guys always want at the start of your movement, you want to have a little bit of tension. If you're working out with your wife, talk about the color of the walls or the drapes. That'll create tension. One, two, three, four. Uh, the air six, seven, eight. He wanted it colder or hotter? Nine. Well, it was always the opposite. Four. No matter what. Three. Were these knockdown fights, you know? No. It was more like, um, you're annoying. No, well, you're annoying. Screw you! <laughs> Let's just hang here. So, my first son was born with some issues, and we were up all night feeding him. 
Here we go, laterals again. Two, three, out to the side. Four, glide, five, six, seven, eight, glide down. nine, Quick up. ten. That's good. Four more. Four, glide. Three, Suck. glide. Close Two, down. shoulders down the back. So, three, two, one, time. It would take us three hours to feed Sam. And then by the time you were done feeding him, he had metabolized everything, was hungry again. Oh. So Lauren and I were up all night long, my ex-wife. And so we got it. It was one night. Sounds we were like both. a movie I saw or something, and the kid just got really, really big, really fast. Or maybe that was like the vampire movie. It might have been the vampire movie. Yeah. Yeah. And then, so we got into this argument at like one in the morning. I said, you shut the F up. And she said, you shut the F up. And then we oh. couldn't stop. And I said, no, you shut the F up. And this went on for like two minutes. And then she just walked into the bedroom, and then I had a. Start feeding Sam again. How and after she left the room, I got the last word. I went, you shut the F up. <laughs> Winner. Okay, what do we got? Forward lunges. Ooh. Front raise. Forward lunges and front raise. So front raise. You can take your ankle so we just did lateral raise, right? Work down the side shoulder. There are three parts of your shoulder, front, middle, and rear. Now we're working the front shoulder, front raise. I'm going to use the same resistance I might use if I go less reps, I might use a little bit more. I have this as eight forward lunges and 10 front raise. Okay. Eight forward lunges is too many. It's going to have to be six. So it's six per leg, and I'll show you what I mean. Take your door anchor, put it to the bottom of the door, lock your door. The and middle bottom anchor. This is, so I'm going to go through one anchor. The middle bottom. I'll, I'll go through the middle anchor. And then on each side, folks, I'm going to be using... Um, I could actually, depending on if you guys have two sets of ankle straps, two sets of handles, whatever, I'm going to use handles for this. I'm going to use handles as well. This exercise is great for your glutes, for your butt, because you have to press off your heel to get back to a standing position. It looks like this, Nicole. They're singles, so it's not a static lunge, it's actually a front lunge. You're going to take the bands, I like to do this with... Arms, so back in bar position like we discussed, the bands are behind my arms. Elbows come. Walk away from the door, the band is pre-stretched. You're gonna take a step towards the anchor, slow, up, one, slow, two. We're gonna go for six per leg of that, and then we stand up and we're doing front raise. And I'm gonna use ankle straps for that. Ankle strap on each. isolating one side first? You're doing six on one side first. Let me see what you're doing. Nope, you're doing that's a reverse lunge. Oh, okay, so yeah, I know it. Mean. Come on back, step forward. Oh, wait. Yeah, these aren't my favorite. And press back. Right, it takes a little while to get used to. But I'm using the same resistance. Maybe she could Okay, help it. if you are having trouble, like Nicole, you're not there yet with a front raise. It's too much resistance. Okay, but regardless, if it doesn't feel natural yet and you want to practice, then you guys can do a reverse lunge, which looks like this. Come to the door, bar position, and you're stepping back. And one. That's my two. way. Okay, but my way will build those incredible glutes. Okay, here we go. Or if it, is, it, is it an alternative? You can, like I said, if it doesn't feel natural for you and it doesn't feel right and you feel like you're going to get injured because you're, you're not totally confident in it, in then stepping. change it up and practice that yeah, for the next time that we do it, but on your own time and you're not rushed. Here we go. Six and six, and then we have eight, and I'm gonna add a three onto that. Okay, here we go. Three, two, one, glide up. Glide, two, glide, three, glide, four, glide, All on the right leg. five, yep. Six, switch legs. Six, five, four, three, step. Two, chest up. One, the knee never goes in front of the toes. Okay, and now we have front raise, remember. Up, glide. Two, three, four, five, like five six, in the front. seven. You can do that. Eight. <sighs> 15 seconds left. I could even do more resistance than that, and I may do that the next time. Here we go. Front lunges. Five seconds. Starting with the right leg. There's glide. One, two, 
Three, back leg should almost touch the floor. Back knee. Six, do you see how my knee's not going past my toe? Six, step, chest stays up. Four, three, two, one. You should have seen the Easter baskets that Nicole put together with her kids. Oh. I'm going to become one of Nicole's children <laughs> in my next life. One, Easter and Christmas. two, glide, That's three, four, Six, seven, eight, or what I was used to as kids. I just do nine, kids. ten. I used to love the Peter Cottontail I swear movie. I saw an Easter bunny when I was like eight. He had a huge, he was huge and had a tuxedo on at the dining room table. Was this after you took a, a little inhale from that funny looking cigarette? No. <laughs> One. This is not. Two. This is actually when I was eight. Three. Right. You started early. It was Four. My uncle. Five. In Glad. The Six. Costume. One. Two. Three. Good. Four. Keep going. Chest up. Five. That's it. Six. Front raise. Breaking off the rust. My right knee is feeling that. If you guys feel pain, you can modify. One, two, glide, three, four, glide, five, six, seven, oh my gosh, you're through eight, all the way over here. 11 seconds. Let's be gone with you, bands. Because I'm having a little bit of knee pain, I'm going to go into a reverse lunge. One, glide, two, glide, three, four. In the name of the game, is to keep moving. In to work around your injuries. Correct form. Six. Yep. And if it doesn't Five. feel right, you find one that does. Four. <laughs> the forward lunges aren't mine. Three. Favorite, but these are. <laughs> Two. And I still feel it in the glutes. Big time. One. And back to front raise. After this, one more minute. One. Glide. Two. Look, shoulders are not up here. They want to come up. Don't let them. Three, Don't four. Let them do it. Arms go up to Don't parallel. Let them do it. Six, seven, eight. Glide. Lock. I'll go for two more. Quick. And ten. Down slow. Nine seconds. Last one. Keep it going. Here we go. Reverse. One. Reverse. 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 Two. Glide. Three. Glide. Four. Five, six, I switch legs. Six, five, four, three. Chest up, abs in. Two from the heel, chest up right. Chest up left. Chest up, correct. All right. Here we Last go. One, best one. Always. One, glide, two, those abs hang out. three, four, a little bend of the legs, five, six, seven, eight, nine, one more, ten. We have one more, folks. How are we doing for time? If your heart rate's not up, you're not using enough resistance. Correct. Ooh, gosh. It's, uh, it's moving on. Awesome. Moving on up. What do you, oh, your shoe. Lou is telling me your shoe. Lou, okay. thanks for my shoe. Four minutes. Lying tricep. <laughs> okay, lying tricep. Door anchor, Here bottom of the door. Do. <laughs> and that's new. Door anchor, bottom of the door. We're going to do. And abs. Let's do it. Okay, so Be for lying on. tricep. How dare I'm gonna, they? I know, it doesn't tell the truth. I'm going with my 30 through one anchor. I'm actually going to go from, a, uh, from an ankle height anchor. Ankle Clip height. on each side. Okay, one up. Looks like this, away from the door. Always good to have a mat. Also prevents you from slipping. Ankle straps this time. Uh, right. So you move away from the door, and arms go down, upper arms to the floor, okay. and one, 
to, I'm gonna have to get a mat, I'm slipping. Are you? Yeah. Slip the banana, are you? That's a lot of resistance, I'm a big dude. You look like a banana. It's good. Okay, and then after that, you're gonna stay right there and you'll do your abs. You'll let go of the bands. Okay. We're gonna do 25 reps of crunches. Oh yeah. I'm gonna bring us down to three minutes first. so we get out of here in a good amount of time. So how many 12 lying triceps extensions? Anytime we triceps to the three muscles on the back of your arm, and anytime that we straighten our arms, we use the triceps. One, glide, two, grounded. three, Lower four. Abs. Keep that upper arm down. Lower back down. Six, seven, eight, nine, like ten, eleven, twelve. Now into crunches, three ways. Most difficult is here, hands across the chest. Lower back stays pressed into the floor. I don't let my shoulders touch the floor. We're here, rib cage to pelvis, that's what we're doing. Heads in alignment with the spine. The next level is here. A little bit easier, fingertips going towards the heels as we keep our head in alignment with the spine. And then the easiest way is hands on thighs, hands straight up on the thighs and go up over the knees. I don't know where I'm at. Rep-wise, okay, I'm gonna stop it there. Go back to tries. Go back to tries. Ground the elbows. Remember, Ground if you don't succeed, elbows. Ground the lower back. try, try, try again. Two, three, four, five. You see me scoot away from the door you to get a little more attention. Eight, up. nine, glide, 10, time under tension, 11, 12, I'm gonna get two more. 13, push it, glide, push it. 14, and abs. So anytime we do the first workout for each day, which there are two days, this is today's day two, I see what works, what doesn't, and then I tweak it. Whew. Okay, I could definitely use more resistance on a few of the exercises for the next time. My abs are fried. One more set of tries. One, two, three, yes, four, okay. five, Six, seven, uh, uh, cramping, Krampus. Some of those electrolyte capsules, magic. Yep, electrolytes. Here we go. One, glide, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, one, two, full reps, three, Four, so when we come back, hands go right over the chest. We're not lifting our elbows up off the floor, they stay down, hand goes right over the chest, and then back down, we straighten, and here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, I have 10 more. Ooh, abs are cramping. Nicole's abs are cramping. Keep it going. They should be Ten, cramping. Nine, eight, That's a good seven, feeling. Six, five, four, three, Send two, oxygen down one. To those abs. Time. Open it up. Oh, yeah. <sighs> Great job, everybody. That was an amazing workout. Look at your resistance levels. Did you use enough? If not, make that note for the next time that we do it. Should be tired. In the comments, if you guys want more ab work, I'll put in a link to a great 30-day ab challenge that someone did over there. You guys can click on that right in YouTube and go check it out and start that and eventually we'll have the way for you guys to track your progress in that as well. Great job. Great job, Nicole Andrews. Great, great job, guys. workout partners. And remember, we're actually gonna be doing Friday's workout tomorrow, um, maybe at nine o'clock. Uh, let's just say tomorrow at 9 o'clock, and we'll okay. see you guys then if you want to do it early. Otherwise, plan on doing it on Friday. Um, love you guys. Tomorrow we also have couples resistance training, and um, we have chiseled cardio, which is really nasty. Woo. Get ready for that. We'll that see you then. Yikes. Have a great one. Have a great day, guys.